Hockey great Gordy Howe continues his remarkable recovery from a stroke after receiving stem cell treatments in Tijuana. CBS News 8 traveled to the clinic in Baja where the stem cells manufactured here in San Diego were implanted into the sports legend known as Mr. Hockey. He was the one guy without a weakness. He had wonderful shots, front hand, back hand. He was amb ambidextrous. Gordie Howe, one of the greatest hockey players of all time, was on his deathbed last year after suffering a stroke. His son, Dr. Murray Howe, had actually started writing his father's eulogy when he received a phone call from Stemetica, a San Diego-based stem cell company. When they said, we think we can help your father, I was, I was beyond, beyond skeptical. Dr. Howe spoke with us via Skype about his decision to take his father to Tijuana to receive stem cell infusions at Norvastem's Clinica Santa Clarita. It became clear to me that it was safe and that it might do something. The clinic uses stem cells manufactured in San Diego and approved for clinical trials in Mexico. This is where Gordy Howe received his neural cell treatment, and this is the room in which he stayed. Doctors at the clinic demonstrated the treatments Gordy Howe received, starting with the injection of stem cells into the spinal column. We use a little bit of local anesthesia, like docaine. The process takes less than 20 minutes. Afterwards, the patient has to lay flat for six hours so the cells can do their work on damaged portions of the brain. So they have to migrate through the spinal fluid up to the brain area. Gordy Howe's stroke had left him unable to walk, but within eight hours of his first stem cell treatment, he sat up in his bed at the clinic. But he said, well, I'll just walk to the bathroom. I said, well, you can't walk. He said, well, the hell I can't. And uh, he sits up and he puts his feet over the edge of the bed, and I was absolutely astounded that he could do that. The next day, Gordy received a second treatment. Como esta? Doctors use an IV solution to slowly inject stem cells into the bloodstream. The cells can help increase oxygen delivery to damaged organs. The whole process takes about an hour. Over the past six months, Novastem has treated about 50 patients for everything from congestive heart failure to strokes, even orthopedic injuries. We cannot claim that we will cure the patients with stem cells, okay? but we can definitely say that patients will have an improvement. Keep in mind, these stem cell treatments are not approved in the United States, as clinical trials attempt to demonstrate a cause and effect success rate. But to Gordy Howe's family, you need only look at this video, recorded in February, two months after his treatment in Tijuana. At this point, you can't even tell he had a stroke. That's, that's what's really amazing. The STEM Medica company paid for the treatments that Gordy Howe received, which cost about $30,000. Howe plans to return to the Tijuana Clinic for a second round of treatments next month.